counting of votes is underway in Kitui West constituency where five candidates are fighting it out for the local seat in a by-election following the death of local MP Francis Nyenze. Wiper candidate Edith Nyenze, the widow, uh, is seeking, is rather leading the pack with a significant margin. Makori Ongechi is at the constituency telling centre and uh, joins us now with the latest. Good evening to you, Makori. Um, how would you ex uh, describe the exercise throughout the day and what was voter turnout like? Well, uh, good evening, Anna. Like you say, we are coming live to you from uh, Martignani Polling Center. Now, this is the constituency tallying center. Well, uh, the exercise uh, began up a bit late uh, due to the heavy downpour that was experienced a bit early this morning. Uh, voter turnout as per now standing at 38.2%. Uh, uh, that is from the 27 polling stations that have, whose, whose votes have been presented and uh, uh, announced here. Now, we have the latest from uh, the the, 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 the votes that have uh, been uh, uh, released or they uh, have been announced here. Now, Edith Nyenze of Waipa is leading with the um, number of 2,403 votes with Robert Mutiso of NAC Kenya coming second with about 355 votes. Dennis Mulwa, who is vying as an independent candidate, uh, coming third with 355 votes with Dr. Freedom Tui and Elijah Kilonzo of Chama Chamungano uh, coming fourth and fifth fifth respectively. Well, uh, we talked to some of the uh, IEBC officials, uh, Ali uh, An, who indicated that uh, this uh, uh, low turnout that was experienced today uh, probably was because this is a by-election uh, plus the heavy downpour that was experienced last night and in the early morning hours of uh, today. And so we are checking up, of course, following on the other uh, uh, votes that are streaming in from the 143 uh, polling stations across this constituency. But, uh, of course, Waipa Party's uh, Edith Nyenze seems to be enjoying the lead, a significant lead, uh, with other uh, aspirants coming uh, far uh, distance uh, from her. And therefore, we will be uh, checking on the uh, latest updates, of course, to update our viewers, even as we check through the results as they stream in and hoping that probably because of the low turnout by around 12 a.m. we probably could have known the member of parliament for Kitui West Ann.